Yeah, this is the Reparation Zone. Giving a shout out to the world. So, Mark, uh, a well-deserved victory this afternoon. You must be absolutely over the moon. <laughs> yeah, I'm absolutely delighted with with the win. Um, we played well. I thought in the first half we were the better team. I by far and away the better chances. Uh, got in front right at the start. We didn't start the second half particularly well, but we knew the way they press and where they put you under pressure that if we could, you know, get those first couple of passes in when we were in the ball, that we could pick them off. And we did that. Got the goal to get in front. A um, bit disappointed with how we kept the ball once we were in front, but we felt really, really comfortable. They're a, a, a very direct side. They put it on you. You know, there's no messing about. It goes up to the strikers, try and get it in behind you. And we stood up to that really, really well. I thought they, they, I can't remember them really having a real chance of any note. Um, so we did what we had to do, classic away performance, I guess, in the second half where we sort of took the pressure and, and put it on the break. We could have had, could have had you know, a little bit more quality at times. We could have had a, one or two more and made it a little bit more comfortable for ourselves. But um, no, I've got to say after last week, you know, we've made some changes. Could have probably made more changes to the team after after last week. And, and we, um, you know, as a sign of respect to Telford, we worked on playing with a, a back three on. on or back five, back three, whichever way you want to look at it. I worked on that on Tuesday night, um, and we're considering going with that. But you know, maybe speaking with Bosch and Tully, just to, you know, got to get back to reality and think. You know, we're top of the league. We've got the most points. We've won the most games. We've scored the most goals. Um, should we change? And we decided not to. But that's a sign of the respect we had for Telford and how, how tough we knew it would be coming here to play against them because they've been been doing so well. So we thought we got the balance right with Adam, Adam coming into midfield. Um, breaking things up when they've been direct and putting it on us, thought that worked quite well. Um, and then ultimately I think we've had those bits of quality on, on the on the break in the in the key moments of the game which is um, as one as it but it's, it's a fantastic win because we've not lost here all season so so delighted with it. Yeah obviously it must it must be really reassuring as well that you've made a few changes today and your team still put performance in like that. Yes, you know we've got a, a, a good not big squad by any stretch of the imagination but we've got a strong squad we know that you know, horses for courses as such, and I think that's that's what it was today. Um, obviously, we lost Shane Killick in the in the warm up, and Conor Branson suspended two of our standout performers this this season. Um, so for the lads to put on that display just shows you know the the strength that, that we've got, um, versatility as well. You know, Adam's done it in a few different positions, Nicky Clay and. Um, and Lewis and OJ playing different positions for us as the season's gone on, they've been, been really good for us. Uh, so yeah, pleasing, we were absolutely delighted with the win coming here, like I say, we know it's such a tough place to come and we've got a lot of respect for the work that they're doing and, and the way they go about the business. Yeah, your team showed a lot of composure in front of goal today with the two goals, but you must be really pre pleased with how resolute the defending was in the late stages as well. Yeah, I thought, I don't think they asked us too many questions, you know, it was it was like the, you know, the hammer at the door as such, they were, they were we, we knew what to expect, but sometimes it's, it's hard to live without. They've got pace up front, strength, good presence up there. Um, so we knew it was coming and we dealt with it, you know, knowing it's going to come and, and dealing with it are two different things. And um, you know, lads, lads back there, I thought Rossi stepping across the centre half was superb for us. Um, Luca won everything in, in the air. Interconnected. All around the globe.